you know, at the end of the day, fastball command is is pretty much the most important thing, um, you know, there is as a, as a pitcher. So, you know, we've been we've been following the process with it, working on it, um, trying to straighten it out a little bit, get less cuts. So, um, you know, when it's when it's kind of having the action that I needed to have, um, it's, it's a lot easier to control. Um, you know, that's that's as much as I could ask for right there. Um, you know, I couldn't be more happy to, to end on a high note like that. And uh, I feel like I'm, I'm definitely ready to go. Having 11 strikeouts at this point doesn't matter who the lineup is. Isn't that quite a confidence builder? Yeah. I mean, um, you know, it's yeah, at the very least, it's indicative of, you know, getting ahead and throwing strikes. So, um, you know, I'll take an outing like that any day. The transformation over the spring has been has been really remarkable. Um, you know, coming in, I, I had a good process down with the, the core below belt and then um, just able to work, you know, a little bit more one on one with Ethan. It's I feel like I've, uh, I've made a lot of strides. At the end of the day, I never I try not to get too high and too low, but, uh, you know, having having more outings like this as opposed to, you know, poor outings is, is definitely a confidence booster. But, um, you know, I, I feel I feel truly ready to go. At, at what moment did it kind of click for you that, you know, you, you kind of figured out that that work was paying off and, and, and the confidence kind of came in for you? Yeah, I think. Um, I think, like I said, originally it was uh, the second inning of my second live BP. And then the fifth inning of my last outing, I felt like something clicked a little bit. So um, it was kind of just, you know, just springing off of those two, those two appearances. Um, you know, I felt like the, I kind of labored the first four innings. Um, and then and then in the fifth, I, I just slowed down a little bit, controlled my, controlled my ride down the mound a little bit, and it kind of just clicked for me. So I, I carried that into my bullpen, and then I carried it into my pregame pen. Um, so I, I was, you know, I felt I felt good going into the game. But the entire uh, starting rotation this spring uh, results have been good. Everybody's putting up good numbers. What's the level of confidence with you guys, Dylan? Yeah, I mean, um, we're definitely not lacking any confidence right now. Um, you know, I, I don't know what else I can say about about you know the other four guys other than they're nasty. Wherever they put me, I'm, I'm you know, I'm going to bring the same process. Um, but yeah, having you know. Having us at the back, I think that gives us a really strong chance to win a lot of games. Carlos has looked really nasty this spring, so um, you know I think we're we're ready to go. With spring training completely behind you now, going forward, are you setting any personal goals for yourself? Yeah, I mean, um, you know, a big one for me is just making all my starts. I, I want to be out on the field, um, and I know if if I'm if I'm eating innings and doing what I can do, then I'm I'm going to give us a good chance to win. So. Uh, just just being out there is the biggest thing for me. And I think, um, you know, first off, the the confidence that he's bringing in. I mean, the guy's a Hall of Famer. Um, you know, he's probably coached he's probably coached more talent than just about anyone around. So, you know, having that level of of experience and expertise definitely, you know, rubs off on us.